CBS News confirms a federal grand jury has indicted former President Trump on charges of mishandling classified documents at his Mar-a-Lago estate in Florida. This is a hugely significant development. It's the first time in American history that a former president has been indicted on federal charges. Three sources familiar with the case say the seven count indictment involves the retention of national defense information, conspiracy and obstruction. Trump made the announcement on his social media platform last night. I'm an innocent man. They come after me because now we're leading in the polls again by a lot against Biden. The indictment comes as Trump has mounted another presidential run. His top 2024 GOP rival, Florida Governor Ron DeSantis, came to his defense on Twitter, posting the weaponization of federal law enforcement represents a mortal threat to a free society. President Biden defended the Justice Department's independence yesterday before the indictment news broke. I have never once, not one single time, suggested the Justice Department what they should do or not do relative to bringing a charge or not bringing a charge. Trump's attorneys say he's at his golf club in Bedminster, New Jersey. A law enforcement official says U.S. Secret Service will meet with Trump's staff and security today to arrange a plan for his travel and arraignment, which is expected Tuesday in Miami Federal Court.